We have two, uh, two training rooms. He had two. I have never been here. First I time. Know. There's one here, and their main room is over here. And I'm going to go over there and get my get changed. I have the, the gang over here. Wow. Videos, cassette. What the hell? Okay. Well, I'm not going to agitate you here. That's for Dan, sure. No, you can use a sword. <laughs> I think you're much better with a sword than me. You get a sword. Uh -uh. Then you'll call it <laughs> self-defense. <laughs> oh my God! What is this? This place. What do you call it? This. Uh, this is our. our uh, what is it? Not kung fu. What no, it? it's tai chi chuan. What's that? You're gonna vlog me. Yeah, I am. Then. What do you oh, think? Geez. I got the camera on. Well, I'm gonna be naked in it. Naked? Go no, ahead. Bug off. Come on. <laughs> okay. Off. That's it. Okay. I'll come after you with a stick. Okay. No, no. You got my attention. No problem there. So what does that say on top? Uh, that says Wu's Tai Chi Chuan Academy. And? Or it says Jin Chuan Tai Chi Chuan Academy. He's one of the Wu family. Wu Jin Chuan. See those pictures above the, uh, the opening there? Yes. Those are the, my teacher's uh, father, grandfather, and great-grandfather. So how did you get involved in this? I was looking for uh, something to get out your frustration. Position down. I wasn't uh, fighting with anybody. I was just always uh, kind of pissed off. And uh, pissed off on what? Who knows? Please come on. This is thirty-seven years ago. Okay. So are we talking about a culture thing? Pissed off? No, I was pissed off with life or something. I, I can't recall. But uh, I uh, heard about uh, this thing they call Tai Chi. And I thought it was just a, a health discipline. I, I went in Parliament Street to my teacher's club. He asked me what I wanted out of Tai Chi. I told him I wanted some uh, contentment and quiet and meditative practices. He said, fine. And so I joined. And a month later, about a month later, I uh, had noticed our pictures on the walls. And they had a picture of a guy uh, being uh, lifted over the hip of another fellow. And I asked my teacher how you do that slow because Tai Chi is practiced slowly. And he looked at me with a weird look and he said, Marty, Tai Chi is a martial art. <laughs> and uh, from that moment on, I knew it was a martial art and I'm still going slow, but I'm awfully fast. How old are you? I'm uh, Old enough to know better than to be talking to you. Uh, well, you've been uh, avoiding me for years. You've been doing good, so you must be getting old. So you're not, you don't know what you're doing. Yeah, right. You're getting C now. This is all I need. Is uh, the TV show years ago, Kung Fu, is that the same thing? No, that was crap. That was David Carradine. And Kung Fu, my Kung, Kung Fu just means technique. And uh, my technique is Tai Chi Chuan. Uh, there's all sorts of techniques or Kung Fu's in the Chinese culture. There's, I can't tell you, there's probably, a, who knows, maybe a hundred different Kung Fu's. But Kung Fu just means technique. Technique. And if it can sell, sell advertisement, that's what they do. That's what it was a TV show. Uh, yeah, and uh, 
the uh, major kung fu, uh, using the word kung fu in their club, is uh, in town here. It used to be homework kung fu. Is that right? If I got that right, or, or that might be a Toronto club. So you got lots of people come here. <clears throat> uh, most we pro I can't tell you how many we've got. What do you got? Oh, mostly old people. Or? Uh, uh, just a moment. You ask one question. I'll answer that. Um, I'm going to guess that we have probably uh, somewhere between forty and forty and sixty, I would say. And uh, the majority of them that I see are um, uh, seniors. Or oh, people plus 50, I'll put it that way, because they're all kinds of ages and health disciplines. And most people do come for health. Uh, we teach martial arts to uh, those who wish to learn it. And uh, those classes are generally in the evenings. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. But, and I say that there are hazards to the teaching, uh, Holy Jesus! Got it? What's that? Hernia? Hmm. Heavy. Which was it? The biggest one? Yeah, the big round one. It's uh, 65 pounds. So am I a wimp? No, you're not a wimp. Try and pick that up with one hand and throw it over your head. Is, I'll put your hand on it. Go ahead. I'm not gonna. Give me a showcase. No, give me nothing. And that gave me nothing. I gave you nothing. What you have is the back of my head. Photograph my ball spot and you'll be happy. Uh, Martin Kennedy successfully completed training. Mm -hmm. Yes. That's a long time ago, 1991. I joined uh, on May the, uh, February the 5th, 1981. Started. Yeah. So being a black guy, that should uh, really control your temper, if you're uh, the other no, and of racist. Guys like you around? Yeah, exactly. Uh, guys like me around, or you got racist. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> no, but, Just no, before no. you went. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, but it self disciplines you to stay calm, right? No, uh, but uh, it gives uh, the thing that you learn most, the more you can learn about uh, martial arts and fighting and that sort of stuff, is the more you walk away from it. There's no value in fighting for no good reason. What about get the over, over the price, you know, over a spilled beer. That's but, what, but what about getting your frustration out? Uh, I don't know. get frustrated. No? I have students for that. <laughs> you, you want to give me some kind of showcase? You want to give me a demonstration? What would you like to see? Go ahead. It's all yours. I'm going to shut up for two minutes. I, I'm not going to do anything for two minutes. Um, I, I'm just going to go and rinse my face off. Give me a moment here. Mm -hmm. right. Yep, go ahead. Just in the door. I would very, I would be very interested in the drum with the sword. The what? Wait, you, you played the drums here? No. What's that doing there? Those are here, because we put them here. Ah, what about the swords? Those are here because we put them to here. Okay, I'll shut up, you go ahead. <laughs> uh, you want to see a sword play? I'll show you a little sword play. A broad sword.
You're on the wrong side of the road. Am I? Wow. That's my broadsword. You know Fight Weber, the iron worker here mm -hmm. in town? His mm -hmm. father made it for me. Wow. It's about three and a half pounds. It's heavier than it should be. Wow. Uh, I'll put on some overheads. Uh, here, uh, let's see. And, uh, you might be best to shoot from that end because it mostly goes in that direction. Yeah, we want to want uh, an accident happening to me, of course. Ready? <laughs> yep. I'm not going to do the whole thing. I'll just do a bit for you. enough. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> that wasn't what it very good, but the, it should suffice to see how the thing moves around. That's good. That's good. good. What's your website? I don't have a website. That, that, if we that, do have a website. I don't pay me. That don't, that don't surprise me one no, day. No, we do. I don't give you. No, what does that mean again? That's uh, commonly referred to as a yin, and yang, a yin yang, but it's about the balance in life that every negative has a positive, every positive has some of a negative in it. All good, Martha. Thank you. All right. Hello. Then. Hello. Oh, I'll get that. When he goes up, lock the doors. <laughs> <laughs> there it is. There, no problem. There's, that's what I was looking for. There you go. And you got seniors like us. No, not like us. Like her. <laughs> they're, they're nice ones. <laughs> Later. So. You want some uh, more bin shape? And this is right on top of the victory meat market. <laughs> 